In this video, I'm going to talk about how to create your very own activity builder. I'm looking at the home page and I need to go to custom in order to activate that process. So now I'm in custom and I want to look in the upper right hand corner. I can create my own polygraph activity or an activity builder. So I'm going to click the activity. And the first thing I need to do is title it. You can always change the name of this title. I am creating one for a second grade teacher. And so there's my title and you can see that the create new activity button is now activated once you have characters in the title position. For sharing settings, I always go with anyone with the link can view. You can make yours private. However, if you create an activity that you want to share with colleagues, you will have to go back and change the settings to anyone with the link can view. If you choose, you can write an um, activity description in the box provided. And by clicking that create new activity button, the program will take me to the editor workspace. How to create the activity and all the different components will be discussed in a different video. Uh, but I do want to now talk about where this activity sits in your account and how to organize it. So to do that, I'm going to go back to the home page by clicking this D. Desmos uses a tagging system um, and a collection system in order to organize. So I'm going to first go to custom because that's where it's sitting. And it hasn't been placed in a folder or collection just yet. And to do that, I press this plus button. So you can see I have many collections. And I'm going to add this one to base 10 blocks. However, if I did not see a collection name that matched the type of activity that I'm making, I can always make a new collection right on the spot. Okay. Now I'm going to save. And it's tagged right here with base 10 blocks. And when I click on my collection link and scroll down, I can see base 10 blocks. It has two activities. One being the activity that I just created. So that is how you create your very own activity within the Desmos platform. And that is also how you organize it. Thanks for watching.